Hi guys and welcome to my channel. So today we're going to learn how to make an intro, how to view restrictions, how to make an outro and upload to end screen, and how to make a thumbnail and ad. Okay guys, let's get right into it. So the app I use to make an intro is called Intro Maker. So for this video, I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys a simple one. Let's just choose a random one. I'll just go with that one right there. And you click on the second one. And next, we will go on and change that title name to your channel name, which mine will be um, Thu Family. And then you can play around with it and change the font color. And you can also change the font style. And after you're you're done choosing, you can go right down to animation right down there and for mine i chose reveal because that's the one that is closest to a uh, typing effect okay guys next we're gonna go down to music and i chose intro and don't forget to copy to clip for credit and once you find the song you like click the down arrow for download and then we're gonna click plus to add and let's see how it sounds. I actually love it, so I'm going to go ahead and export it. And copy for credit. And save to camera roll. And that's it. Now you can add it to your video. Okay, guys, let's go on to the next one to view restriction. So you go to your channel and go to YouTube Studio. And then you're going to choose content. And down in that section is where restriction is. So if you have like a copyright, it will show right up on there. Okay, guys, now let's get it into making an outro. So for this, I also use the app Intro Maker. And for this video, I'm also going to show you guys a simple one. So I'm going to go with that one over there. And then you click on the second box and in that circle right there that's where you can add in a picture or logo so now we're going to go down to picture and you're going to click on the plus to add in a picture or logo and i'm going to use the family for mine and now you're just going to choose a frame and you're going to center it when you're done you click the check mark and now you're just going to adjust the logo and picture to fit onto the circle after that you're going to slide that all the way down and you guys can choose to change the wordings right there, but I'm just going to leave it the same. So when you're done, you click the check mark. Now it's processing. And then you're going to save. And I'm going to show you guys another app I use. I mainly use this app to add in music. It's called Video Leap. So now you're going to click the plus sign. And you're going to click and select the video you just created and then you're going to go down to music and type in outro find the music you like then download it and now we're going to cut the length to match the uh, video the length of the video let's hear how it sounds And then you're gonna save it and now you can add it to the end of your video and now to add a video to your end screen you're gonna go to your channel go to YouTube studio and then you're gonna go to content and you select the video you uploaded you're gonna scroll down to end screen and then we're gonna drag all the way down to where the end screen is You're going to click on the box and select video, drag that all the way down to the end screen. And then now we're going to center it, so try to center and then press play. And now we're going to adjust it to fit onto there.
And that's it. Now we're going to press save and then you're set. Okay, guys, now let's move on to making a thumbnail. So the app I use is called YT Video Thumbnail Maker. So now we're going to click on Thumbnail Maker. Select the picture you want for the thumbnail. And then we're going to go to the letter A for text. And now I'm going to type in Karen Song, Fill the Empty Chair. And when you're finished, you just click Done. Okay, guys, now you can make the word smaller and place it where you want. You can also choose the layout you want. And you can also change the background color. And you guys can add or change the stroke color. You can also change the font style. And then you can also change the font um, color. And guys, just um, play around with it and try to um, create the best thumbnail you can think of. And then next, we are going to go down to camera. And we're going to click cut out. And now you're going to choose the picture you want to cut out. So I'm going to go with that one over there. And so now I'm going to trace around the picture to cut it out. And then you're going to click the check mark when you're done. Okay, guys, now I'm going to add stroke to the picture. You click there when you're done. And I'm just going to adjust and place the picture where I want it to be. So I'm just going to place it right there. And I'm going to try to center the words where I want it again. And when you're done, you're just going to click the arrow there. And then we're going to save the picture. And now let's go to YouTube Studio to upload the thumbnail. I'm going to refresh it and then I'm going to choose the video I want to add the thumbnail. And you click on the pencil. Then you click on the pencil again. And you're going to choose custom thumbnail. And then I'm going to choose a thumbnail I just created. And you click select. And then you just save it. And now I'm going to refresh it to see if the thumbnail is added. And yep, it's added. And that's all, you guys. You are set. And thank you for watching. If you want more video, comment down below.